Milken Theatre goers, it's time to enter the Reader's Digest Condensed Playhouse for an evening of fine entertainment. Tonight we'll feature three outstanding plays condensed for television by your hostess, Pamela Foster Masterson. Thank you for joining us this evening. I'm sure you'll enjoy your stay. Let's get started, shall we? Our first offering is by the immortal bard himself, the very immortal William Shakespeare. It's one of my very favorites, the immortal Romeo and Juliet. It's a story of two young lovers who die because they are very young, very much in love, and very stupid. Our tale begins at a grand masquerade party in Verona a very long time ago. Hello. Hello. I love you. I love you. I'd, I'd rather, rather die, die than, than live, live without, without you. you. This cannot be. You are a Montague, and you are a Capulet. No, wait a minute. You are a Capulet, and you... No. Never mind. The bottom line is you kids have to call it quits. No, no. I'd rather die than live without Romeo. I'm going to take this, this deadly poison and end it all. Gasp! Yes. Oh, oh, no! I can't live if living is without her. What happened? Oh, Romeo, it was only pretend poison. Oh, woe is me. Bravo, bravo. The immortal Romeo and Juliet, tragic but to the point. And now let's go from the immortal Shakespeare to the equally immortal Rogers and Hammerstein. We'd like to present for you our production of Oklahoma, one of my very favorites. Let's get started, shall we? Oklahoma! Miss Lowe, I love you. People, People will, will say, say we're, we're in, in love. love. I want to marry you, Miss oh. Lowe. Not if I can help it. I say we've been for the hand of Miss Lowe. I've been everything I own, myself. I guess you really do love Miss Lori. She's yours. Dearly beloved, we're gathered here today, etc., etc., etc. I now pronounce a man and wife. I can't cope. I can't last another day without Miss Lori. Oh, whatever came over me? God, he's dead. Whoa, with me. <coughs> Marve, Marve, a lesson to be learned, I'm sure. And now for one of my special favorites by the immortal Fyodor Dostoevsky, the famous Seven Brides for Seven Brothers. We are seven brides. We are seven brothers. Cheers. Gasp. Brother, 